Before the start of this video, I would like to point out that this 4 tips might not fix the FPS issues for everyone. It worked for me and I think it will work for a lot of people, but not everyone. So for the people for whom this does not work, you're going to have to wait for the official patch from the developer themselves. The first tip is the most basic one. Update your graphics driver. Open up your GeForce experience and go to the driver section. Here you will see that Nvidia recently released a driver just for Naraka. The version is 471.68. This driver should help stabilize the performance for most users. The second tip was provided by the devs themselves during the final beta testing. The solution is to basically set Naraka application to max performance mode. Right click on desktop, select Nvidia control panel, select manage 3D settings, then program settings, click on add, Select Narga game application from here. Scroll down the options and find power management mode. This by default is set to use global settings, but you're gonna change it to prefer maximum performance. And click on apply. During the final beta testing, this actually helped increase my performance. It didn't completely fix the stuttering and FPS drops, but I could clearly see the improvement. The third tip does not help with FPS drops, but it helps with stuttering and makes the game load faster. And it's to install the game on SSD and not on your hard drive. If you don't have an SSD, then this will not work for you. You might have noticed that the main menu takes a lot of time to load, but when you get into a game, the character select screen takes a lot of time to load. This solution helps fix it. If you install the game on your hard drive, the game itself will tell you in the title screen to install the game on SSD as it helps with stuttering. Naraka is only around 10 GB in download, so reinstalling the game on SSD should not be a problem. I had the game installed on my hard drive, which is my E drive at first, but later on switched to SSD, which is my C drive, and clearly saw the difference on load times. The final and the most important tip for FPS drop is to use this command on advanced launch option. I will leave it in the description box below. I found this tip on Reddit by a user named Box of Joes, who in turn found about it from a Twitter user Voxel Heart. So kudos to this guys. Here they mention that this tip only works if you have a 16 GB RAM or more. I have a 16 GB RAM, so it worked for me. If you have less than that, try it anyway. Maybe it will still work. So open your Steam, go to Library, right-click on Naraka Blade Point, select Properties. Here you can see the launch options. This by default is empty. Paste the code here and just close the box. This is the tip that really helped me fix the FPS drop and my game actually works really smoothly now. So these are the 4 tips that work for me. I suggest you guys do all the 4 above. If it still didn't work, then I'm sorry, you're gonna have to wait for the official patch from the devs themselves. Thank you for watching.